To create an auxiliary track, would press Shift Command N for new track. Hold Command and on your keypad, press the down arrow uh, to get auxiliary input. And say we want one mono auxiliary input, press Enter to confirm that. And that's our auxiliary track there. Uh, now we have to set the input of that track. So we go up to the IO section here and where it says no input, click on that little triangle and we need to select a bus. So we'll select bus one. And then to send signal to that track, uh, we'll go over to here. This is our audio track, uh, vocals, uh, and go up to this send a sends AE, A to E section and click on this little section and then go bus one and then uh, it will bring up this little floating fader and this fader uh, determines how much signal you're sending to your auxiliary track. Um, so say I want to bring that to 0 dB, I can just hold Alt and then click on the fader, bring it back, bring it up to 0 dB. Um, if you have pre-selected, it will send signal before this fader and if you have unselected, it will send signal after this fader. So if it's pre, whatever you do here on this fader won't affect the signal sent to your auxiliary track. If it's not selected, it's after the fader. So whatever you, uh, whatever you do here on this fader will, will affect the signal being sent to this auxiliary track. And auxiliary tracks are normally used for uh, reverbs, mainly uh, effects and different things. Um, so you can go up to this insert section, press up here, go to plugins, go reverb, so air reverb mono. And then we could go over, here, over to this floating fader. Send signal there. Um, select whatever settings you want on your reverb, and then it will send. Uh, you probably won't be able to hear that because I don't have the um, outputs of Pro Tools into my screen recorder, but that's all right. You can see that that's sending from that track to that track, going through the reverb, and then you can turn the reverb down and you. Uh, adjusts how wet or dry your signal is. Um, so yeah, that is all I have to say about that.